Hi everyone, welcome back to another Flutter tutorial. Today we are going to learn how to connect our Flutter project with the Firebase. First we have tried it in our Android simulator. After that we have tried it in our iOS simulator as well. Let's start. First we create a brand new Flutter project. Firebase project. After we have successfully created. Now we have run it. After running successfully, we know that until now our project is working fine. Let's dive into our Google console. First go to the console.firebase.google.com and create your account. After that, click on add project, Flutter project, create that. I have disabled it and it takes some time to create project. Now our project is ready. After that. First, we have connect our Firebase in our Android app. Now, we need a package name. Now, we go to our Android app level build.gradle file. And here is the application ID. You can copy this and paste it here. And remaining are optional. We have registered the app. Now, download the Google service.json and place it in our android app we have copy it and we have go to our shorter firebase project inside the android app and we have paste it here now we have check it you can see that google service.json and we have next and here we have copy this and root label view.gradle before we have pasting that in new flutter update there is the missing of some file you have watched carefully i'll provide you the link is in description first you need to add the build script x kotlin version after that we have copy it from here and carefully paste it here and we have missing one bracket you need to add this otherwise you got the error after that we have copy the dependency section and paste it here you can see this you need to add this to class path after that you save it and leave it from there after that we go to app level builder gradle and copy the copy this id and paste it in our plugin section remember it this three id is already is in our plugin section otherwise you got error and that's it you don't need to add this dependency next it continue and we have back add the firebase core oh. add dependency firebase core after adding this dependency we make our main async you can see this our package is successfully added after that we add these two line just and all are done and import our firebase core package we have terminate our app and reinstall let's see open our debug console if all are correct then our app is running successfully otherwise it gives error and terminates our app let's see you can see we have not faced any error all are done successfully and our app is completely working like previous you can see this if you have got any error your app is not run and not working as well we have connect our photo project with firebase in our android app now we have dives into the ios section add ios ios is quite easy a bundle id is required 
we have go to iOS section, run our X code, and inside project PVX project, the bundle ID, you can go to three one three seven one. 371 line and there is the project bundle identifier and copy this line and paste it here all are optional you forget this and register our app and download this info.plist file and we can place it and we can place it inside our runner Google service info dot finish. We have copied this iOS inside this runner. We have pasted here. Paste. See this inside our runner. There is Google service info dot finish along with info dot finish. And crash this. That's it. iOS section is quite easy. Then Android, we have continue our project and we have also tried to run our app in our iOS simulator. We can run this. We have successfully connect our Flutter Firebase project in our Android and iOS simulator.